Good evening. I'm Meg Gatto. A pickup truck slams into a Laplace home, taking out a brick wall with it. Tonight, residents who live in the neighborhood where the accident happened say it's an all too common occurrence and they want the problem fixed. The accident happened in a split second. And my uh, neighbor said, you know, I, he saw, you know, the truck, you know, jump. Nearby surveillance cameras captured the startling footage. A man who residents tell us was being chased by St. John the Baptist Parish deputies along Woodland Drive, slams into a fence, and then the back of the Palma family home. Only five or maybe ten minutes before, you know, I was right there in the room, you know. Lenore Palma says she just left her grandson's bedroom to do laundry. Then she heard what sounded like an explosion and saw deputies running towards her house with their guns drawn. I'm screaming and I can talk. I tell you I can talk because my tongue is stuck and my body shake. The sheer force of impact sent truck debris flying. Some of it even lodged between the gutters and the home's roof. Portions of the fence went flying too, ending up on the other side of the home. It could have been worse. It could, it could have been a lot worse. John DeLume lives across the street. Our fence has been hit once. Down the street, has been three times. Uh, we've called a number of times to get barriers put up to protect fences and all. They don't want to do it. What's it going to take, a dead person, two dead people? Neighbor Kathy Pennington says the speed limit on Woodland Drive is only 35 miles per hour, but few people obey it. They finally put the little signs up, the little yellow signs uh, up to like to show that there is a curve, but unfortunately people still speed and they run off the street and hit the fence. Pennington and others want to see more enforcement by St. John deputies. John DeLoom says the problem's been going on for far too long. Been out here 15 years and can't get anything done. The Palmas say they're ready to move because they're so afraid of something like this happening again. Although they've got quite a mess to clean up, they're very thankful no one in their house was injured. This replace no problem. Yeah, the life is more important. A spokesperson for St. John Parish says the accident is still under investigation, but the parish is going to take a look at that particular stretch of Woodland Drive to see what else can be done to keep people safe.